What's up, everyone? Welcome to the Power Play with CJ. I'm to focus in on uh, a tale of two prospects in Minnesota, or tale of two prospects to really kind of troll. Um, with Alex Tuck going to the minor leagues, reporting to the AHL, um, Iowa Wild, and Joel Erickson Eck making mini out of camp. Um, I I like the move with Tuck. Here's the thing. Not making the WJC team last year or not even getting a look in camp was kind of surprising. But I think he's a hell of a prospect. He's a kind of power forward you need in today's game. Moves well, can bring you some physicality, some tenacity, work the corners, all that shit. So that's that. I, I'm i I'm team Alex Tuck. Um, but Erickson Ak intrigues me as a prospect. I think he's a very good, very creative forward. Do I think he's lapsed Tuck? No. I, I, first of all, it's a marathon, not a sprint. And just because a 19-year-old right now is slightly ahead ahead of a 20-year-old, it's like, what? You know, that Pro Hockey Talk will sit out the right wings they have on their depth chart in Minnesota. You know, Zucker, Palmerville, Coyle, Stewart. You know, good luck trying to break into that group. So, again... I think Tuck will definitely take the ball and run with it in the AHL, use the AHL seasoning to his advantage, and be up at some point this season a better, more polished professional player. Eric Sendak being on the opening night roster, I think, gives them some youth and uh, you know creativity down the middle that I think they, they can use um, and gives you, you know, kind of a different dynamic as that number three center. So I like it. I think it's the move makes sense, um, and we'll see what happens um, over the course of the next you know, a few months with the Wild, but I think the only thing I, that I read about Erickson Eck is, I guess, uh, Russo from the Tribune tweeted this, that if he ends up getting sent down, he's going back to Sweden, not to the AHL, so I don't know if that, I don't think that pressured Minnesota into keeping him up, because if he goes back to Sweden, who gives a shit, he's still going to get, you know, good development over there, but, you know, I'd rather have him over here playing North American hockey, but I understand where the, where the kid's coming from. You know, if you're not going to be in the NHL, you might as well be playing closer to home. Kind of a no-brainer there. So we'll see what happens. I like both prospects. So, anyway, that's all I got in this episode of the Power Play with CJ. Stay tuned for episodes throughout the, throughout the preseason and beyond. Later, guys.